JB help call JB call JB Hello 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 JB Hello 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 Go 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 JB help Hello everybody everybody all the princess all the queen the king under this life go JB help Today I'm very pleased. I have so many of my queen here. Uh T, how you doing? <laughs> my different nurse underscore flying 911 in the house. Thank you everybody. Everybody who is already here. Kelly. How you doing, my dear friend Kelly? How you doing? Uh we are happy to see you. Somebody talk about Vezo Vigo. We're going to talk about this in just a minute. But I'm going to tell you what we'll be talking about today. The main thing we're going to talk about, Bell Kim, good afternoon. How you doing? Uh everybody, everybody who is already tapping on that screen. Today we are going to talk about things that you can do in case uh my dear friend Ollie Willis, thank you for those beautiful words. We're going to talk about what you can do in case of an emergency. If somebody is going through an emergency what do you do again guys my name is JB I'm a family practitioner the family practitioner the brother that believes that educating my people that should be my job that's the best thing that I could do for my community that's what I'm about to do now let me tell you what I'm about to teach you here by the way if you didn't know here yeah, my friend say call 911 but before you call 911 I'm about to tell you some simple things that you could do if somebody is having that type of emergency one of the biggest 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 emergency they could have now just so you know uh if uh what I'm about to talk to you about right now um it's something that I teach so for those of you who didn't know I am a uh, an instructor for the American Heart Association. So I teach people about how to take care of people who goes in cardiac arrest means when somebody's heart stop. I teach. Now, I know that on this show usually I preach the idea of being the mechanic of your body teaching people to be the mechanic. So if you go on Google and you type uh CPR with JB, uh you kind of see my my name there, my picture there. So you're going to see my dear friend Queen C. Thank you for the beautiful rose. Appreciate you. Thank you for being there. Thank you for the great work you're doing out there. Uh I see that you're doing some great work, so I'm very proud of you. Um so the thing is um if you go on online on Google and you were to type CPR with JB and you're going to see how many comments that I have. You're going to see my reviews. You're going to see what people say about CPR with JB. It's me, JB. <laughs> So, I teach CPR classes and I teach those people how to understand the heart. It's different from just saying, well, because American Heart says so. Obviously, I am an instructor for the American Heart Association uh to teach those classes, but I have a lot of people like uh in the area, most of the MDs, NPs, PAs, all those uh, you know, critical care nurses, all of them take this class. And what we should do if you go online, <laughs> Google CPR with JB. You will see what they say about me and you will see why I call myself the brother <laughs> the brother who is uh, trying to teach you to be the very very good mechanic of your body that's why today we'll talk about what do you do if somebody is on the ground and most likely if somebody's heart stop what do you do what do you do oh, yes obviously like my friends say thank you for everybody who's tapping on that screen it shows how much love you have for JB it shows how much you love the go JB health show I appreciate y'all for that but again today we're going to see what do I do if somebody's heart stop yes i'm going to call 911 but before before my friend Josephine how you doing before you call 911 what do you do what can you do i'm about to tell you that right now on go to be health so the thing is as i said this is something i teach you a lot 
and uh, obviously the reviews the reviews online on google can tell you uh, over 100 something reviews five star people not just just put in a a, a a check mark but you talk about people who describe what the go jb is all about <laughs> not just go jb but cpr with jb what it's about they'll tell you how i break down the heart look at those reviews you will say my friend uh um uh, curry my friend curry lioni thank you for sharing the live appreciate you my dear my dear very friend uh one of my queens <laughs> What do I do? Uh, what do I do if uh, somebody's heart stops in front of me? What do I do? You never know. Nico, my dear friend, my dear supporter, uh, my dear subscriber to this platform. Why do I have to say? I do have a little video out there. You guys could see it. We starting that Go JB accountability group for weight loss so if you are dealing with issue with weight loss we got an opportunity for you my different bear of cam giving us roses all of them freshly picked all of them oh, i could see they're so beautiful so anyway so queen c thank you for sharing this video you know how much i appreciate you so uh, if you are having issue with weight loss and you are trying to find ways you need ideas you need more one and one time with your brother to give you some ideas so the same thing that i do here in this office i'm about to do it online for my queen for my king my prince or my princess i want to do this and the good thing is the same plan that i'm doing online but it will be free of charge i know one of my supporters sent me a message today say what's the opportunity well the opportunity is that the something that everybody's coming here in this office to pay for you get in it free the only thing that will be excluded is the medicine so we're not gonna give medicine uh we only do the medicine for the people who come still to this office but just so you know the weight loss the bigger part of it is not the medicine thank you my dear friend for that big old heart i appreciate you but we will be doing this program it will be a uh, it will be a platform it will be an environment of uh boosting you boosting you and giving you the best plan to help you lose weight so that was just a side note so i do have this out there oh you know i haven't had it posted on my youtube yet but i'm about to post it on my youtube once i finish here by the way you know this show will be posted on youtube as well i'll have it posted on youtube because everybody who want to be part of it the first thing you gotta go youtube you subscribe to our channel on youtube you're gonna go under this video you're gonna send me a message to say yes you are interested in being part of this program this is gonna be a very beneficial program no pressure it costs you nothing so uh it it, it uh okay so is that better now my friend uh is it better my friend who says sound fuzzy is it better because remember i would like for you to hear me loud and clear my friend bev cam is it better now please let me know So it's still not better okay what's happened then okay so what about right now is it better can anybody having problem with uh can anybody having uh sounds good to me okay v my dear friend v says sounds good okay bev came it looks like it's good now so but yeah as i was saying so any of you if you have any problem or if you need uh, so if you need um, okay so let's see what's going on with the sound then How does it sound now to you guys is it better again i'm here i want to make sure that i give good sound sounds good okay so does it sound good for you uh was that uh my uh modu sounds good so uh was that andrew that asked that uh, quincy good it looks so for most people it looks like the sounds is good now so thank you guys for um 
bringing it to my attention i'm glad it sounds good now so that's good okay so as we were saying uh i am having this group where we are uh having a way of motivating people about losing weight so if you know anybody who is willing to lose weight just tell them go to the go jb on youtube they're gonna become a subscriber and then they will send me a message there's that short little video that i post on there uh, that talks about this program they will be sending me a message through this under this video to say hey yes uh jb i want to be part of this group if you want to be part of this group we will put you as being part of it it doesn't cost you anything again we're gonna share exactly the same thing that i do for my patients here i'm doing this i'm doing this just to support the people who are supporting me online i think maybe that's an opportunity that i have to support them so uh so yes um thank you my friend who said uh, it must be that person's location that they didn't hear me but i want to do this to support those of you guys my queen uh the people who are very supportive of me the people who are tapping on the screen i wanted to do something and i'm doing this free of charge it's not costing you anything so we're gonna do this where we will have this group we're gonna share where we at we're gonna uh it's like more like a session where we sit down we know where we at and we know what we're gonna do uh one two three four this is what you're gonna do and that's where we're gonna be so this is just a side note so just so you guys know uh this program we are launching uh, we are launching it so if you just uh so if we're launching this so if you are um interested uh you know how to get us and again on my page here it does give the explanation of what you need to do but this little video will be posted on the youtube right after this show so you guys will be able to go and uh be able to if you're not subscribed you'll be able to subscribe but also you will be able to go and send me that message so i put you uh put your name as part of this group that would help with people who want to turn yourself people who want to lose weight people who are trying to find ways especially natural ways that we could work together to see how you could remove that weight let's see what we could do together to make that happen now if you if if you sit somewhere somebody's heart stop what are you going to do yeah i have a lot of people here who are saying uh they want to be part of it uh yeah, if you want to be part of it it's easy so we're gonna have plenty of time so yes so absolutely you can be part of this group uh it will be available to you my friend uh, we're gonna get to know each other we're gonna be able to communicate and see why are we losing the weight uh and obviously we also gonna advise you even we don't we're not gonna give you medicine but if, when we talk to you if we think there could be some medical problems that is causing you to gain weight we're also going to advise you on the best way that you could uh, possibly um you know best thing you could do if you need some testing uh obviously we're not going to be able to do it here but we could encourage uh, or you could recommend that we go to your doctor and ask them to do certain testing for you so pretty much it's just going to be a free service that i'm offering to you guys that i love so much uh it doesn't cost you anything to do that but anyway if somebody's heart stop what do you do so you do cpr so cpr many people know cpr now the thing is people think i have to be in the medical field quincy thank you for the roses i love it i love you thank you very very much appreciate you very very much so people think i have to be in the medical field to be able to help somebody's hearts uh, uh somebody whose heart stop people think if somebody lay on the ground i can all i can do is just call 911 well while you're calling 911 there are some great things that you could do again as i said this is what i teach here uh as part of what i do here we teach cpr classes if you go to cpr with jb uh in atlanta you will see that uh you will see the review that i have you will see why uh many people call us somebody who is teaching people want to be the mechanic of their body you see what they say about when it comes to me explaining the heart to somebody you're gonna see it for yourself look at the reviews you'll see what people say anyway so um um so i uh what i'm gonna do is uh for the people who say the music aloud i just put it down i'm hoping it works now so if somebody's heart stops so uh or you suspect somebody is on the ground you think their heart stopped the first thing you're gonna do is obviously as i was saying you're gonna call for help you can call 911 could put your phone on speaker no worry my bro uh 
or my sis whoever it is user 37 so um uh so the first thing you're going to do is to call 911 put your phone on speaker and you're gonna go and check for a pulse today i know you are not you may not be in the medical field you are watching me here but i'm gonna teach you how what a pulse is and how to check for a pulse My friend Trudy say that she had to perform it a, a couple of times. Great. So, but anyway, so you're gonna put your phone on speaker, call for help to call for help to call 911, and then you're gonna approach the person. Obviously, you know, uh, you're gonna check them to see if they're responding to you, um, and you're going to perform CPR. Now, before you perform CPR, you need to check for a pulse. What is a pulse? A pulse is pretty much you're just checking to see if the heart is beating so how do you know somebody's heart is not beating because i do know there's a lot of time when i teach this class here there's so many people who mistaken breathing with heart beating now if your heart is if you have problem breathing breathing is just me doing This is breathing. You see when you know that chest going up and down, up and down. This is breathing. Now, your heartbeat, your heartbeat is actually something that is sent by a part of your heart that's called ventricle that is sending this beat. And there are different places to check it. Now, you want to check a carotid pulse. If you check here, and anybody, if you if you want, you could even like if you check here, as you're watching this, if you call here. You're gonna you're gonna check my friend say no pulse uh cool grandma well that's a cool name uh squeeze it but if you check here you're gonna feel that beep 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 this is the pulse this pulse is nothing but the heart beating every time this part of the heart squeeze to push blood into our body then it make it 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 makes you feel that little beat this is what the pulse is so you're gonna approach them you're gonna check for a pulse you're gonna see and and one of the things that you could also see if you have more questions about this you could always send me uh questions you have if you need to know more about this but one other thing that you can do if you go online you could you could google like uh, a picture that has all the different places for pulses but usually we do a carotid pulse because it's it's stronger it's closer to the heart so we like to do that so but when you check the pulse uh thank you my friend user uh user 37 thank you i'm proud of you for your support i'm proud of so many people who are supporting me and what i'm doing so believe it or not i i really appreciate you so the thing is when you check for that pulse if you don't feel a pulse what it means it means the heart stopped beating so now again uh our heart is what keeps me talking to you so i'm talking to you because of how i have a heart that is beating and it has to be beating all the time all the time all the time it can't stop my heart cannot take break my heart cannot go on vacation it has to be beating all the time my friend uniquely or oh, unique lewis how you doing my friend unique lewis thank you for being here so your heart has to be beating so what happens when this person is on the ground you check for a pulse there is no pause it's when their heart stop okay what is the heart <laughs> uh, my friend diane uh diane thank you for being here i'm doing good so uh michelle good afternoon how you doing so a heart I think we talked about this before. A heart is a pump. Okay, a pump. I think everybody here under this live is familiar with what a pump is. So a pump is something that is pumping something, right? Maybe pumping oil, you may be pumping water, but the heart is a pump that is pumping blood. Now where is that blood is being pumped to? yes my friend said it's your body's engine yes because the thing is this pump you could have a pump for irrigation for instance a pump that is pumping water to water crops or plants or whatever so all these are pumps but our heart is the most important pump 
on, on earth it's our pump if that pump fell the pump fails we fail so this is why it is very important for me and uh, this is why I'm so excited to be one of the people that teach so many people about the heart obviously those people they come for this class because all the hospitals everywhere to be in the medical field the people who work on daycare they always have to come here to take that class but I'm very proud because this class is a community service where every time I teach somebody this class here I get you certified but what I think is thinking about the community thinking about myself thinking about my children thinking about anybody in the community everybody who learn about this class then that's why I said anybody who is watching here and you want to know more about the CPR class you're not gonna have a certification because you don't come here for to take the class but I will teach you as much as I can if you need to know more so anyway what happened is this pump that we have uh, uh, no problem my friend uh, truly yourself man I have seen so many uh, truly yourself fashion I have seen so many beautiful screen name it's just amazing and so many of them Queen are my some of my dear dear friend with the best screen name <laughs> but anyway so what happens is uh, and thank you for everybody who is tapping on the screen by the uh, by the way because I mean I've seen a lot of people uh, been liking this live I appreciate all of you guys I have to take the little note the little side note to say that but anyway so the heart is a pump so what happened is people who are in cardiac arrest the pump stop working now if you have a pump at your house saying you have a pump in your basement that is pumping water because your your basement is so wet you got a pump that is pumping that water out of the basement and the pump fail what do you do you know what you do you're gonna go ahead by hand <laughs> you're gonna go ahead you're gonna find some buckets you're gonna try to carry the water from your basement out of the house obviously that's what you're gonna do right because the pump is not working right if you have a pump that is water in your plant if the pump stop working you're gonna use it now guys just so you know I'm from Haiti I'm Haitian and I have a lot of people a lot of friends from Africa so some of you who may have visited other countries or maybe who, look, who have looked at documentary from other countries you may see that we use pumps a lot on wells so you have a well you put a pump on the wells and now in the past in this country as well they used to do that before we had all this thing that we have but anyway so they have a well that has a pump on it and this pump is pumping water from the deep from deep uh, from the bottom of the well and when there is a problem with that pump what we do we're gonna take manually we're gonna try to pump that blood okay I'm trying to make you understand that analogy Michelle thank you for sharing the life <laughs> we do say tell me about it well so the thing is what I'm doing here I'm trying to show you the analogy so we talk about a pump we talk about different type of pumps we talk about a pump that you use from back home everything right but now hello my friend uh, Thindi how you doing thank you for being here uh, so again everybody if you have not followed me yet please follow I have to always talk about this follow thing uh, everybody who is sharing the video like my friend uh, Diaby diabetic uh, something uh, so thank you diabetic savage uh, mystery uh, thank you for sharing uh, I have 11 uh, 11 one Shan no two thank you for sharing I'm um, do thank you for liking everybody who's liking who's sharing I appreciate you know that I love every one of you for supporting me in this great work that I'm doing here so yes I have a lot of appreciation for you guys so I want you to know that dearly personally you guys mean a lot to me you guys are part of me a part of my family now that you know that I hang out with every day so hey but anyway, so when you have that pump that fails, you're going to try to work the pump manually. So, which tells us exactly what CPR is. <laughs> you would never believe how many people you're going to say, what is CPR? Why do you do CPR? Why are you pushing on that person's chest? And they'll be like, well, I don't know. Maybe because American heart says so. Because CPR classes say so, right? So, 
<laughs> speaking of heart you have a big heart well thank you uh my friend says speaking of hearts you have a big heart <laughs> or you have a big one thank you so well thank you to you thank you to you you have a big heart too because uh, everybody who is tapping on that screen everybody who is liking what we're doing really it's because they have a great heart like somebody like Ingrid you know Ingrid who is giving us those roses she has a great heart because she want to support something that is supporting her community but anyway what I was saying is because the pump fell then we go manually we're gonna manually work the pump we're gonna go ahead and push on that chest when you're pushing on the chest you're not just pushing on the chest for fun when you see it on Grey's Anatomy you see those people pushing on those chests <laughs> my job and that's the job uh that i do for uh that, that's the job that um i do for every class that i teach here that's the job that i do for every patient that i talk to that the job that i do on the show here it's to try to make you understand in simple terms it doesn't have to be a mystery all these things are things that we can understand we don't have to be going to medical school to know that somebody's heart stop. I'm going to push on the chest. I'm going to push on the heart. This is why I'm doing it. Why can't you understand that? I mean, something very simple, right? You, Y'all are very smart people. I can teach you this and you could understand it for yourself. So next time, if you see somebody, whether you're looking at Grey's Anatomy or wherever you're looking at it, you see somebody pushing on somebody's chest, doing what we call CPR, then you would know that my brother JB shared that with me here, that he educated me, that I know that people are doing this. It's because the God-given pump is not working. <laughs> So, uh, so CPR is great to know. Yeah, obviously. So the thing is, I am telling you today that we are pushing on that chest because the heart stopped. So when the heart stopped, we look at the heart. What is the heart? The heart is a pump. So the pump stopped working. Therefore, we're going to be pushing on it. We're not pushing on it for fun. We're not pushing on it to show off, but we're pushing on the heart. It's more like when we're pushing on the chest, it's almost like I'm taking your heart that you have here. I'm taking it. I'm squeezing it for you. You know why I'm squeezing it for you? Because it stopped squeezing on its own because that's what you want. You want a heart that is automatically squeezing you want a heart that is automatically beating but when you are in cardiac arrest for the most part the situation you see people doing cpr is because that heart that you have that is supposed to be beating automatically is stop working because it stopped working it stopped beating then you're not gonna have a pulse because obviously the pump is not sending the signal the pump is not sending that blood that has to go everywhere that blood that goes to my brain that allows me to talk to you that blood that goes to those hands that are moving that blood that goes to my brain the part that that is in charge of me talking to you so then this heart is doing all this work that brain that blood that goes to that that part in your brain that tells you hey brother jb is doing a great thing on go jb i need to go 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 jb with him because he's doing a good job and it making you pushing on the screen to say let me give him some like let me share his videos so this is because our heart allows us to do that so the minute this heart stopped then we're not gonna be able to do that now the bad thing is If we don't get somebody, a good Samaritan, somebody maybe that was part of the Go JB Health Show, who knows exactly, they need to go there, check that pulse, and if that pulse is not there to make sure that they start that CPR, guess what's happened? We're going somewhere. I don't know, heaven, hopefully, heaven, but we're done. This is why it is so important for us to start CPR. Immediately, if somebody doesn't have a pulse, we wanna start CPR. Because if we don't start CPR, again, we know what CPR is. Everybody who is part of this Go JB, I want you to know what CPR is. Really, CPR is just taking that heart. So if somebody doesn't come to help that heart that stop beating, if somebody doesn't stop and say, hey, you know what, heart, let me give you a hand. Guess what? <laughs> CPR saved my life 40 years ago. Yay, my friend. 
then I'm happy because you know what? That is extremely important. Everybody should have a basic of this thing. So my friend Loja, Low Gems, Lou Gems, uh, Lou Gems Shaker. Thank you for sharing the live, my dear friend, Lou Gems Shaker. So the thing is your heart stop. So somebody comes, they have to come and some people will give us a jump start but anyway so what they have to do is come and squeeze your heart for you because your heart is not beating i have a lot of people sharing this live i appreciate all of you guys so the heart is not beating therefore you need some help somebody comes there and they're pushing on the chest pushing on the chest i mean they're squeezing the heart you see how we do cpr and try to listen to your paws it goes so we try to do the cpr which we, we do a rate of 100 to 120 uh compressions per minute so what we try to do is mimic your heart mimic the way your heart is usually work so that's what we try to do when we do cpr so therefore as i said if you don't have a good samaritan if you don't have a good brother my friend abby zoe how you doing thank you for being here if you don't have a good brother a good sister a good samaritan in the area when your heart stops to come and start pushing on this heart i'm telling you i'm telling you it's a big problem <laughs> Now, my friend is asking me a very, very big question. My friend, I don't think you want me to get there. <laughs> no worry, no worry, no worry. Just, just send me a message. No worry. So my friend is saying, why does the heart stop beating? I don't know. This is a very more technical topic. I do teach, by the way, I teach two type of classes here. I teach the basic CPR and I teach the advanced cardiac classes. That's the classes I teach to more like uh, uh, the the NPs, the doctors, uh, the uh, you know the doctors, the nurses, and the critical care nurses. That's what I do. So where I talk about this thing. So how many people wanna know? How many people would want me to talk about why the heart stopped beating? Again, it's it's a little bit of a more of a topic. I know we are uh, getting to the very end but some people may not even be interested in that so uh anybody want to know why the heart stop some people here my friend cool grandma <laughs> cool grandma 562 says hidden heart disease causes problems somebody say a lot of reasons let me break it down in just a simple thing. So uh, here's the thing. So and because my friend then they say, yes, please, let's talk about it. Let's go. So your heart has two parts that makes it work. OK, you got two parts in your heart that makes it work. OK, and again, my friends, yeah, I agree. A lot of diseases, everything. But this is what it results to. So just to summarize it, my friend Michelle. <laughs> so your heart has two men part the two men part that makes me talk to you now that makes my heart to be beating one of them is electricity the other one is mus muscles so it's like you have the mechanical part of the heart and you have the electrical part of the heart i'm sorry guys if i lose anybody but uh so uh bear with me i'm trying to explain it in a very simple word so what happens is you have the electrical part of the heart is the uh, the part that leads the heart that tells the heart when that tells the muscles when to beat or when to squeeze which gives you the heartbeat and you have the mechanical part of the heart which are the muscles which would squeeze or relax squeeze or relax that's what gives us the heartbeat now um when people's heart stop it's because there is an irregularity either the messenger that is supposed to send the message to the heart which is the electrical part fail or the muscles itself does not respond to the signal so really those are the two main reasons my heart will stop now uh let's look at the pump again we look at a pump so you look at any machine that you have at home there are two part of most machines that you have the same thing with the heart so you have two parts one of them is the electrical part and the other one is the physical part so pretty much the heart is a robot right it's a robot it's like you have a fin at home 
okay you have a fan the fan is electricity you plug it into electricity the electricity uh send the signal into those parts and it makes the fan work so the heart is about the same thing so you have the electrical part of the heart which something if you're in the medical field there's something that's called the sa node uh so which is the actual main leader of this heart i call it the president of the heart so it sends the signal to say to tell the muscles how often should they squeeze and how often should they relax um so then that electricity is sent to the muscles then the muscles do something whether it relax or squeeze so heart squeeze it sends the pulse out that's what we feeling here we're feeling the um the, the the pulse so really mainly it's because you lost the leadership of the heart so again it could cause by a lot of reasons that could cause the loss of that leadership but usually it's you you lost the leadership mean you lost the electrical part of your heart saying you see some people may have a, a a pacemaker for instance people who has a pacemaker it's because uh which that probably more more familiar with a lot of you guys a lot of the new followers here i love you guys but like a pacemaker for instance if somebody has a pacemaker it's because that electrical part a pacemaker is part of the electrical part of the heart so it's like we have issue with the electrical part of our heart then therefore they give you a pacemaker which is electricity you see so if you're familiar with pacemaker sometimes they say well we have to change the battery or something you know so it really it's electricity so they send this to send the signal to your muscles to tell your muscles to do certain things because what usually happens with the pacemaker is because our heart is not sending the signal on time so again in a nutshell the main reasons that a heart would stop is really if you have problem with your electrical part of the heart or if you have problem with the muscles not responding to the signal this is why they call me jb this is why this show is called code jb means we're gonna go we're gonna continue to provide education every day we're gonna bring more education again if you miss the show by the way you know that it's gonna be available uh, on youtube later on today we're gonna continue to provide education uh beverly thank you for the rose appreciate that um so this is what we do here this is why you have so many people following gojb and also this is why if you go on cpr with jb on google that's why you see so many reviews about this brother you're gonna see what the people say i don't tell them what to say they say it based on what they see they come here they meet me we meet we have a good time they can tell you what we do that has always been what we've been doing we're not just doing it on tiktok we do it everywhere we go again when you go there <laughs> you know when you go there you're gonna see yeah you're gonna see the reviews you see what my people those people who come here to take this class they will show you they will tell you overall when you read everything they will say that jb is very big about making you understand so that's why I'm making you the mechanic of your body. <laughs> now I don't know. You may go somewhere. Some people may think you know too much now. But that's my job. My job is to make sure all those deep people like Beverly Thomas. <laughs> make sure all my different Bev Cam, all these people. <laughs> oh my topper is tired. I gotta get back to work. <laughs> My friend, I, I'm happy that you were here with us today. I appreciate you. <laughs> but the show will be available tonight on YouTube. Again, if you want to be part of our weight loss program, wait for that YouTube uh, video to be posted on there. Send me a message on YouTube. First, first you got to be a subscriber. Send me a message. We're going to be looking uh, together and how we could help you. If you're tired of that weight, my dear friend, roses roses and it's like a tennis ball cool thank you my friend appreciate you a lot of roses a lot a lot of roses appreciate you as usual my dear friend bev cam
So, yes, uh, again, um, as I said, uh, this is uh, what we enjoy doing. We enjoy uh, teaching people. So uh, I think that's the first time, actually, I talk about CPR with JB. You guys didn't know. <laughs> but Go JB or Brother JB doesn't just come here to do this TikTok. But we've been doing this for a while. We've been teaching people. You are very welcome. Unique Lewis. Thank you. Thank you to you for your support. No worry. No worry, my friend. Devamon. Devamon. Or Devamon. Devamon. Um, thank you for being here. Appreciate you. But again, everybody, this show, if you knew, it's uh, 1 p.m. Eastern Time. Every day, Monday through Friday. And now we are anticipating of having one day on YouTube uh, on YouTube on uh, on Saturday we're thinking but we're still thinking but obviously we're gonna have a show on YouTube we're gonna have a meeting I'm gonna call it a meeting with my people who sign up for that weight loss program uh, yes uh, CPR class Pretty much every day, I always have one or two class. Well, not at least every day or every other day, I always have classes. Because what happens, I'm in this clinic all day. So really, we just schedule people throughout the day to come and be educated about the best way of taking care of a heart. <laughs> you are very welcome, my friend Randy Clark, who said, uh, great show. It's my pleasure. There's a lot of more plans coming up. We're making it even better. Better every day. Because remember, it's go. Go, JB Health. Go, 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 JB Health. So we're going to keep going. When we say go, we're going to go higher and higher, like I always say. HPV. My friend say, did you talk about HPV? You guys want to be having HPV as the topic tomorrow? I want to see how many people want to want us to talk about HPV tomorrow as our topic. <laughs> Somebody say you seem like a very nice man. Thank you. Appreciate it. From our queen. No worry, go ahead, do your thing. But anyway, so whoever was saying if we were holding classes, so uh, really, if uh, if you need a class, yes, we always have classes here. Somebody say I am and JB. There we go. That's where you need to be. <laughs> the great place. Where we're having fun and we're teaching our people. That's what we do. Now, as far as classes, you know you have to come in to get a class. <laughs> I do have people every once in a while calling, say, "Well, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out of state. Can I get a class?" No, I could always talk to you about you know some of those things, but you cannot be certified with me because American Heart doesn't have that option of somebody doing an online class yet. Actually, I talked to them the other day because I was thinking you know maybe some of my friends uh, who've been asking me but still you gotta come in if you are in Georgia come here meet up with coach JB <laughs> meet up with your brother because uh, we will be teaching you the class you feel happy if you keep asking people they're gonna tell you one thing about this class and you don't even have to ask if you go to my page on Google CPR with JB, they will tell you that one of the things is I'm different because of how I teach this thing. I'm in Georgia, my friend, my dear friend Michelle. Uh, I am in Georgia. In a, well, not Atlanta, but very close to Atlanta. I'm in a town that's called Smyrna. And if you're in Georgia, again, I'm right across from that train track over there. So on Atlanta Road, that's where I am. About two o'clock, 
it's about time for us to go north carolina my friend my friend masha in north carolina thank you for everybody who has been tapping on the screen thank you for everybody who sent us so much gift on this live thank you for you who always share this very precious time with us i hope you believe that we really love you that you really mean a big difference in so many so many people's life somebody from houston michelle is in houston okay clearwater in the house mz cup <laughs> clearwater thank you for being here i have so many queens from everywhere around this uh this planet <laughs> that are following me that are supporting me but you know they know they're supporting me because they're supporting a good cause my friend 75 hottest <laughs> artists <laughs> Tennessee in the house, my friend Trudy from Tennex from Tennessee. It's very hard. It's very nice that you were here. Thank you. I saw that you do the lot of tapping on the screen. And also, uh, somebody say we love you for what you do. Well, my friend V, <laughs> thank you. I know you guys love me. I know that I'm very loved by so many, so many of y'all. This is why we'll continue to work for you for you thank you my seven my friend 75 artists <laughs> thank you for those uh, beautiful fire <laughs> that's really deserve a lot of fire <laughs> my b friend ucki5 in new jersey you see guys it's people from everywhere I have so many uh, queen from every part of this country and all over the world. I'm not afraid because I love what I'm doing. I enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, I get like you know. I, I'm 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 very happy with what I do. And my different 75 artists is in Maryland, Maryland. Here's my friend V is in Virginia Beach, VA. And the house. Every day. <laughs> Every day. Those people they come here to give you the love, to tap on the screen. That's amazing, man. I mean, really. And I do have another friend, Michelle, M129, who is in Jamaica. <laughs> you see? So that's not in the US. <laughs> so it's people everywhere. Go JB blessing to you. <laughs> yeah, thank you, my dear friend. Well, I have a couple of Michelles in this show here. Now I need to say which Michelle am I talking about? It's like that's what happened when you have so many queen. You know, queens of power. If they say they behind you, that's it. <laughs> But if you're new to this platform, we encourage that you follow me. Follow me so you know whenever I'm live. And uh, believe it or not, when you go to my page, it's so much that you're going to learn. It's all about learning. Nothing about joking. Yes, we may make you laugh. <laughs> yeah, we got to make it fun. But we need to do it where we educate you about something. Look at my videos. Tell me which one didn't teach you about something. And that's what we're doing every day. Every, every day. Yes. Funny from Jamaica. <laughs> everybody, everybody. All my precious people. I want to say once again, thank you to you. Thank you for the opportunity once again to show me love. Yeah, thank you for this opportunity. Thank you for everybody who tap on the screen. We all are cousins. <laughs> thank you to all the cousins. Okay, guys. So, <laughs> this is about the end of the show. Thank you very, very much. Uh, thank you for being here. 
Thank you for your support, uh, for the support of GoJB. The people who subscribe to this platform, I always forget to talk about subscription. Again, every time I'm here, I'm so I like I got so um, amazed or excited. So I always forget about subscription. Well, you guys know there is something that is called subscription on TikTok. So you could always click on where it says subscribe on the very top and become a subscriber to this platform. I'll be very appreciative of you. You could just do like uh, my friend Bevcam do, like in a lot of other friends who do become subscribers. So uh, tomorrow is 1 p.m. Every day, 1 p.m. Eastern time. Tomorrow is, yes. So Monday through Friday, 1 p.m. Eastern time. That's where we at. But again, if you miss anything, this is being loaded on YouTube. Again, anybody, if you want to be part of our weight loss accountability program, you could always let me know and we will include you in that group. This is a group where I'm going to use the same uh, principle, the same technique that I use here for my weight loss program in this clinic. So I can talk to you guys about the best way of uh you know maintaining a good weight or and again i mean obviously even though you're not overweight you could still join this program because it will teach you about toning yourself it also it's more like a counseling session it's just sitting with you having a conversation making you boosting you to be stronger like oh my queen to be stronger stronger than you are but anyway so Thank you, uh, everybody. Uh, thank you, everybody. I think it's about time for me to get out of here. Uh, but I appreciate y'all. I appreciate you guys. I love you. Um, again, I love you once again. And I, as I always say, you go and you go again. You go with your brother, JB. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you very, very, very much uh, to you. Uh, you are you are doing a good job thank you my dear friend if i could hear that from all these people i don't care because my people loves me and i'm gonna continue to make them proud so i'm proud of every single one of you for the support for uh, you know well my my okay so heart feel heavy also yeah somebody say heart heavy i cannot run like this so that's one of my friends here one of my queen here uh, says that thank you I have had a rough couple of days lately feeling lighter thanks my heart felt heavy well uh, if you have any problem with your heart are you telling me you have a heart problem uh, so if you do I want you to do and do a follow-up on this uh, as soon as possible thank you my friend clock who said keep up with good job so uh, my friend Renee Clark. Uh, so yeah, so I would say my friend, if your heart, when you say your heart feel heavy, I don't know, is it stress? Well, if you stressed out, I'm so sorry. But again, um, th I, that may be one other thing. You may want to be part of this accountability group. Again, it's not just about losing weight, but this is a group where we're going to talk about a lot of stuff. We're going to help you cope with things better because what happens is uh, stress can cause you to gain weight. Uh, you know stress can cause you a lot of stuff so what we try to do my weight loss program here in this office it encompasses the mental aspect it's like what is the weight is, is causing you uh, as far as your thinking the way you see yourself your self-esteem and everything then I look at uh, what are you doing at home what are you eating how are you taking care of yourself okay so we look at all that we look at the top of exercises and the third part is looking at medications uh so we may start you on some medicine however the program that i'm have i'm making it clear the program that i'm have like the accountability group that we have in doesn't include anything to do with medicine at all it's just gonna be more like those two first part it's gonna help you to build your self-esteem and things like that so really that's what we're gonna be doing on that in that group uh it's not no medicine only people who come here because you cannot be giving medicine to somebody you're just talking to them on a video call again even though sometimes we do telemedicine but this weight loss is not about telemedicine but we don't do the medicine but we're gonna do the other part for free on our accountability group and youtube so if you haven't signed up on our youtube if you haven't subscribed yet go to youtube subscribe to my channel and then um you know send me a message to say you want to be part of this group
So thank you everybody. Thank you for being here today. Uh, once again, uh, thank you. I uh, appreciate y'all. Y'all take care. Have a great day. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This conclude our great health education show for today. Thank you very much. Thank you to every, every single one of you who spent this precious time with us. Again, if you're new to this platform, we encourage that you follow us so you know whenever we are live the next time. This show comes on every day, Monday to Friday, 1 p.m. Eastern Time. My name is JB. I'm a family nurse practitioner who believes in educating his people, who believes on supporting his brothers and sisters by sharing his knowledge with them. If you missed the show again, it will be available on our YouTube channel. And if you have not followed us on YouTube, Instagram, or Twitter, we encourage that you do that now. Again, once again, the people who tap on the screen to give us the likes, the people who shared the video, the people who became new followers, those who gave us gifts on the show, the roses. We want to say thank you to every one of you. Thank you to the people who subscribe to this platform. We want to say thank you to every one of you. Thank you for believing that together we could promote health, that together we could educate hundreds, hundreds of millions of people. I want to say thank you to every one of you. I really appreciate the support that I have all throughout this country but also even all over the world we have a lot of people supporting this great project of education again thank you for being here until i see you the next time you stay with great health